Gracias, Padre Guillermo. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Amelie. I want to introduce you to other Amelies that came late. Steve Conserva, Padre Conserva. Number two. Así que, welcome to St. Stephen. You see what a wild community we have here. And to all my other brothers, thank you. But we have two very special persons here. We mentioned in our prayers, Sister Susan Joseph of St. Augustine. Estamos hablando de oraciones a las hermanas de San de San, de San, Jose, de San Agustín. Ellas llevan el tiempo que esta iglesia funcionando, trabajando aquí. They've been here since the church began. And with the others, they too are moving on to other missions. So I want to invite their superior and Sister Mary David. La superiora y la hermana de Father Alex wants me to say thank you. But the thank you goes not just to all of you, but to these wonderful men that have served here. So, thank you, Father Alex. Mary David, you've been my right hand person in many places with the kids here. I know you're in San you are, are you in San Agustin already? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And I was more. But uh, we still remember you, we'll, we'll miss you. Uh, you were my right hand, especially with the school. I went through those transitions, and then you helped me to do one out there. Well, I will miss it very much here. I've been here 23, going on 24 years. And I've been with these wonderful men. These wonderful men and priests have been a wonderful example to all of us. And I hope you will always keep them in your prayers for the missionary work they have yet to do. Thank you. We have a little token for yourself later on, okay? All right. My brother Oblix, I know some Oblix would like to say thank you. Father Jim Flavin, Father Flavin. When I came to St. Stephen's uh, in 1968, I served in this church for 12 years. And the big secret is I'm a better priest today because of my years here, because of the love and the help that people give. So this is the most, this is the most special church in my life to me. So I am very grateful for all of you. I think the future of St. Stephen's is bright, and I thank God I'll be able to return here again to visit on another occasion. So, uh, I give my thanks to you, Rafael Dios, and uh, Viva la Parroquia San Esteban. La parroquia San Esteban por 12 años en 1968. Creo yo soy un nuevo sacerdote hoy por la ayuda y el amor de la gente de la parroquia San Esteban. Yo estoy muy agradecida para usted. El futuro de San Esteban es luminoso. Yo volveré a visitar a San Esteban en otras ocasiones. Entonces, vaya conmigo, viva la parodia San Esteban. Oh. 
el padre Gerardo que lo vieron muchas veces para Jerry muchísimas gracias para la parroquia de San Esteban para su hospital su generosidad cada vez que tengo un día de descanso lo paso con ustedes aquí para la misa y para, para cantar con ustedes en canción maravillosa a, a, a los cantados hoy y coro formidable Uh, when I had a day off, I would come here uh, to St. Stephen's and uh, spend some time. And uh, you guys are so generous and so gracious to me personally. And you always had great hospitality. Uh, I think you know the elders have learned from you, and you have learned from the elders. Thank you to God. Bless you. Thank you, Jerry. As you all know, I was born, oh, I wasn't born in this community, but I was, I was raised in this community, and even though the order, our order is leaving, this will always be home, and I thank you because if you made it a home for me, I was growing up, and it will continue to be so. Ustedes saben que yo crecí en esta comunidad, y aunque ya yo me he ido de esta comunidad, y los holandos también se van, siempre será mi hogar, y les doy las gracias a ustedes porque lo han hecho un hogar para los holandos que han pasado por aquí a través de los años, y porque están dispuestos a, a darle una nueva bien, bienvenida a sacerdotes nuevos que quieren ayudar a ustedes y servir con ustedes. Así que apóyenlos y denle gracias a Dios y sigan orando por las vocaciones para que tengamos más jóvenes, eh, jóvenes que, que den testimonio del Evangelio de Cristo. Amén. You came with a storm, you came with many things here, eh? Nosotros no, no estamos saliendo solamente de la parroquia San Esteban, sino de la diócesis, de arquidiócesis de Miami, ¿eh? Como hemos ya dejado otra parroquia, de que yo veo muchas caras aquí presentes. There are people here a large group of people here from a parish that the Oblates already left. A parish that I was sent to, I was 34 years old, I was a grown man when I was ordained, and I thought I knew everything. <laughs> and I got there to begin my ministry as priest to discover I didn't know anything. <laughs> La gente de aquella parroquia, the people of that parish, with their love and support by my seeing the service and the holiness that they had, I learned what it meant to be a priest. And just when I thought I figured that out, the provincial said, go to be a pastor. That's a different thing. You haven't been a pastor yet, Father Patrick? Oh, you have? Okay, good. Because it's a very different thing than just being a priest. And I got here knowing what it means to be a priest and knowing zero about what it means to be a pastor. But here we find people so filled with the love of God and with hearts that are given to service that it didn't take long for me to learn. And I thank you for that. Yo no sabía nada de lo que es ser párroco cuando me enviaron aquí para ser párroco por la primera vez. Pero al verme tan perdido extendieron las manos para ayudarme y con tanto amor que me brindaron y tanto ejemplo que me han dado de lo que es ser un misionero de servir a los demás yo aprendí, yo creo <risa> muchísimas gracias a ustedes y la única cosa que yo pido es que siguen amando a otros, especialmente los recién llegados a la parroquia, los desconocidos, brindando a él el mismo amor que me ha mostrado a mí y que me ha afirmado. Y yo soy amado por Dios, porque eso es llevar la buena nueva de Dios. Thank you very much. We have one of our ladies.
evil when I say something. Honey Scott, come on up. <laughs> <laughs>